Beautiful guys. So what we're gonna be doing right now is going over the cable lap prayer. So first and foremost, I would say choose the handle. Most of you guys are gonna have a rope at your gym. If you know you have this by a chance, you can go ahead and use it as well. But most of you are gonna have this. If you do have this, um, I would definitely say go with this. You can get a way better stretch and it just feels a lot smoother. So I'm gonna walk you guys through the movement as I'm going through it because it is very technical. So I really wanna explain what I'm doing, giving you guys a visual. So first and foremost with this movement, you don't wanna overload it too much to the point where you're breaking form throughout the whole motion. So what I do here, I, what I do here is always go a little bit lighter just to make sure that I can fully contract and get a full stretch at the bottom. So starting to position myself, I wanna drive those hips back. You're gonna notice me pushing my chest through my arms. This is gonna allow me to get a really big stretch on the lats. When I'm here, what I wanna do is I wanna engage the lats. So I wanna pull down a little bit and I want to keep that going. And then as I get closer, I bring my chest up, which allows me to contract at the top. And as I'm going down, I'm driving the hips back, pushing my chest through my arms, get the full stretch. And then again, come back down, come up to get, to get a full contraction. And then push your chest. So you want to watch out for not getting um, enough range of motion. A lot of people just kind of do this, right? So when you do this, you're not really stretching too much. So you want to make sure you get that full stretch. And that right there breaks it down for you guys.